When I was younger, I used to consider myself a stuffed animal queen of my own house because I had like a million stuffed animals and I honestly, I wouldn't even be surprised if that's an accurate number. I, th I used to have this couch chair thing that had a pattern that reminded me of a royal throne. So I used to sit on it all the time with a little princess crown on and right next to me I would have my royal assistant, aka my favorite and all-time favorite stuffed animal right next to me at all times. I, I even used to hold little meetings every now and then when I got a brand new stuffed animal from Build-A-Bear or whatever. I on a, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> a majority of my stuffed animals are actually from Build-A-Bear. I remember exactly that there, this worker person there, I saw her almost all the time. And whenever I walk past the Build-A-Bear at my local mall, I even still see her. And I bet she still remembers me because I was there almost every week trying to get the brand new My Little Pony Special Edition stuffed animal. Get it now before it's gone forever. Rest in peace. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that... That, that that was pretty fun. I think she was very annoyed at me, actually. Anyway, back to the story. I held meetings all the time. I used to put all of my stuffed animals on my bed in probably, like, alphabetical order. And then when I got home, I brought the animal, stuffed animal, I say that a lot. <laughs> I brought the stuffed animal out of the bag, and I used to sit it there and be the queen that I was. And it went something like this. Hear ye, hear ye! Uh, wow. <laughs> Can't even do that. Hear ye, hear ye, everyone! All stuffed animals, welcome to the like third stuffed animal meeting of this week. I am your queen, here to serve you all. Not serve you all, that's not what I meant to say. <laughs> I am here to show you all the brand new member of our family. And then it like ripped it out of the bag and it was like, here she is, everyone. Do your oohs and ahs and everything. And it was actually really fun and I kind of want to do that for my own video. Well, like, separate vlog thing. I'm getting off topic a lot. <laughs> Okay, there was another time that I had where I threw all of my stuffed animals probably down the stairs. I just remember having them all in the living room. Everything was full, or and sometimes I did this in my room as well. I had an army of stuffed animals. I pretended, once again, being the queen of stuffed animals, I sat just there in the living room. Oh my god, this is really dumb. I sat there in the living room above all of my stuffed friends <laughs> and commanded them all to go and fight. Fight what? I have no clue. It was probably just a bunch of monsters in my imagination. And I just sat, I just stood there being the queen that I was. Like it was a fire emblem game or whatever. Just Commanding them all to do whatever they do. I don't have a script for this video. Can you tell? <laughs> oh, oh boy. Um, I'm gonna end the video here before we get too weird. Um, yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching this really, really weird video. It's obvious I didn't have a script for it. Um, yeah, I want to give a quick shout out to Master Slake Animations who made my very first two fan arts. And honestly, I'm going to hang that on a wall. I'm going to print that and put it somewhere on a wall. I don't know where, but somewhere. <laughs> I'll do that. Uh, yeah, so uh, thanks for watching again. I never know what to do for these endings, so um, yeah, uh, don't die by... <laughs>